Well, first at four, shocking new details after a man was critically injured as three teenagers took off in his car. Video shows the victim holding on to the top of his car the moment the thieves crash it into a fire hydrant in Queens. Right now, one of the suspects is still on the run. Eyewitness News reporter Darla Miles live in Richmond Hill with the very latest. Darla. Good afternoon, uh, David and Liz. That crash, the violent, dramatic video that you just saw, came to an end right here behind me. It was only about a tenth of a mile from where the car was stolen. And right now, the 28 year old man who was an inspiring RB singer with music already on Spotify, he is in critical condition at Jamaica Hospital. He had to have part of his right skull removed because of so much swelling on his brain. I heard a squeaking noise was coming from all the way down the block and it was coming so fast and suddenly so I hear a boom. A stolen Lexus screeching down Leopards Boulevard hits a hydrant and then flips over on its side. That car belonging to 28 year old Torre Thompson who was thrown from the roof during the violent Monday night crash. It happened near the intersection of Leopards Boulevard and Liberty Avenue in Richmond Hill, Queens. One of the guys was hanging on the side of the car and then he flew off from over there, he hit the hydrant and he flew off till the end of the block over there. Friends say Thompson was picking up a DoorDash order from Taco Bell just around the corner when police say the car was left idling and had been stolen by three teens. This is surveillance video of Thompson just before the incident, walking into a nearby store. A few minutes later, he's seen running to his car and then hanging onto its roof. He saw his car door closing. He started running outside, I opened the door for him. He tried to open the door, he couldn't open, then he jumped on top of the car. And this is surveillance video of the suspects walking down the sidewalk just before jumping into the Lexus. It was three people outside walking, they got ski masks. You saw them in the ski mask? Yeah. Those three teens also seen climbing out of the stolen car and making a run for it. At first, bystanders run to them to help and didn't initially notice Thompson lying on the sidewalk. When I climb out, I see a lot of people. When I look, I see a guy lying down over there. So again, uh, two teens, two 15-year-old boys, in fact, have been arrested uh, in this carjacking. One is still at large, 28-year-old Torrey Thompson in critical condition at Jamaica Hospital.